The 100 Civic History and Government Question and Answer for the Naturalization Test are listed on this video. The Civic Test is an oral test and the USCIS officer will ask the applicant up to 10 of the 100 Civic Question. An applicant must answer 6 out of the 10 questions correctly to pass the civic portion of the naturalization test. On the naturalization test, an answer may change because of elections or appointments. As you study for the test, make sure that you know the most current answer for these questions. Answer this question with the name of the official who is serving at the time of your eligibility interview with the USCIS. The USCIS officer will not accept an incorrect answer. Although USCIS is aware that there may be additional correct answers for the 100 civic question, applicants are encouraged to respond to the civic question using the answer provided in this video. American Government Principles of American Democracy What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. What does the Constitution do? Set up the government. The idea of self-government it is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. What is an amendment? A change to the Constitution. What do we call the first ten amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? A speech. How many amendments does the Constitution have? Twenty-seven. What did the Declaration of Independence do? Announce our independence from Great Britain. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life and Liberty What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. What is the economy system in the United States? Market economy. What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. System of Government Name one branch or part of the government Congress What stop one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Separation of power.
who is in charge of the executive branch the president who make a federal law Congress What are two parts of the US Congress? The Senate and House of Representatives. How many US senators are there? One hundred. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six years. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Answer can be different. District of Columbia resident and resident of the U.S. territory should answer that D.C. or the territory where the applicant lives has no U.S. senators. The House of Representatives has how many body members? Four hundred thirty-five. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Two years. Name your U.S. representative. Answer may change. A resident of territory with non-voting delegate or resident commissioner may provide the name of that delegate or commissioner. Also acceptable is any statement that the territory has no voting representative in Congress. Who does a U.S. Senator represent? All people of the state. Why do some states have more representative than other states? because of the state's population. We elect the President of the United States for how many years? Four years. In what months do we vote for President? November. What is the name of the President of the United States now? The President name is going to be on the description of this video. What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? The name of the Vice President is going to be on the description in this video. If the President can no longer serve, who became a President? The Vice President. If both the President and the Vice President can no longer serve, who become a President? The Speaker of the House. Who is the Commander-in-Chief of the Military? The President.
Who signs bills to become laws? The president. Who betos bills? The president. What do the president's cabinet do? Advise the president. What are two cabinet level positions? Secretary of Agriculture and Commerce. What do the judicial branch do? Review laws. What is the highest court in the United States? Supreme Court. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? Check the link or the description in this video. Under our Constitution, some power belongs to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. Under our Constitution, some power belongs to the state. What is one power of the state? Provide a schooling and education. Who is the governor of your state now? Please check your state website for that information. What is the capital of your state? Please check your state website for that information. What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. What is the political party of the president now? You can find the information on the description of this video. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Please check the link or you can find the information on the description of this video. Rights and Responsibilities There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Citizen 18 and older can vote. What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? Serve on a jury. Name one right only for United States citizen. Vote in a federal election.
What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of expression and speech. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allianz? The United States flag. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Defend the Constitution and law of the United States. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? Eighteen and older. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote and join a political party. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax form? April 15th. When must all men register for the selected services? Between 18 and 26. Colonial period and independence. What is one reason colonists came to America? Freedom. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? American Indians. What group of people was taken to America and sold as a slave? Africans. Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes, taxation without representation. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? 4, 1776. There were 13 original states, named three. New York, New Jersey, Pennsylvania. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. When was the Constitution written? 1787 The Federalist paper supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution, named one of the writers, James Madison. What is one thing Benjamin Franco is famous for? U.S. diplomat.
Who is the father of our country? George Washington. Who was the first president? George Washington. What territory did the United States buy from French in 1803? Louisiana. Name one of the war fought by the United States in the 1800. Civil War. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did Free the Slave Emancipation Proclamation. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Free the Slave. What did Susan V. Anthony do? for woman rights. Recent American history and other important historical information. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. Vietnam War. Who was the president during World War I? Woodrow Wilson. Who was president during Great Depression and World War II? Franklin Roosevelt. Who did the United States fight in the World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. Before he was a president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil rights movement. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? Fall for civil rights. What major event happened on September 11, 2001 in the United States? Terrorists attack the United States.
Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Cherokee. Name one of the two longer river in the United States. Mississippi. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Pacific Ocean. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic Ocean. Name one U.S. territory. Puerto Rico. Name one state that border Canada. Michigan. Name one state that border Mexico. California. What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. Where is the Status of Liberty? New York Harbor Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because there is one star for each state. What is the name of the national anthem? The Star Spangled Banner. When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4. Name two national U.S. holidays. Thanksgiving and Christmas. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel. Good luck with your interview. Gracias por ver este video. Suscríbete a mi canal. Buena suerte con tu entrevista.